Hello friends, we have with us Ms. Anita Gupta. She is the principal of Roman Munjal Vidya Mandir. Um, how are you feeling to witness the new normal education leadership summit and award? So, uh, first of all, I would like to thank Adacom for organizing such a wonderful, enriching, uh, uh, you can say, conference, and which is actually experiential learning. Because it's just not we are talking about uh, general things or theoretical things we are having a delve depth and reaching sessions talking about the practicality of whatever the concepts have been introduced through NEP or NS NCF is uh, the thing and the use of technology so it's the amalgamation uh, amalgamation of innovation technology skill and whatever can be adapted in the school curriculum. Yeah. How are you implementing technology in your school? So, see, technology is going to stay forever. We all know that. So, no school or no education sector or no, nobody can be away from it. So, when it comes to my school, so we are lucky enough because computer education and all, it was started uh, almost two decades before. Right. So we already were aware of, but when suddenly uh, this pandemic had struck, so we were like easy to make our teachers understand and our students also how to go about uh, with the online classes. Okay. So then we made it a part and parcel in the daily uh, teaching also. Because we earlier uh, to pandemic, we even introduced the smart board concept in our classes and every classroom has got. So they were already aware of that technology is there to stay. We were already aware, students knew, parents also knew, we were teaching teachers to have the curriculum. So in that way, we didn't face the problems and now also we are able to. So we have uh, the technological, uh, you can say the problems. Of course, because when it comes to like net issues are there or how to uh, make a stop at what level. So these things are there, but otherwise technology definitely is a great tool, not just in terms of its uh, physical presence, but also the soft content it has got. It's only thing is we have to make our students and the whole environment to understand that this is how you are going to make use of it. So when we know how to use it, when we are enabled, then we can make use of it. And that's what we are, going, going, uh, we are doing it, not only in the subject enrichment activities, but also otherwise also. Like if I say, like it's too easy to take the uh, students to the virtual tour of any place and to connect them off uh, with the experiences, feeling it, so lively seeing the things like what we talk about VR, reality, AI and all these kind of things, they can experience it themselves. Right. So that's how we are making use of, we, are, we have embedded it in our curriculum. Okay. Right. I'm, I'm happy to share that Adorcom Media has completed two years of its existence and we are celebrating our second anniversary this time. So any message for Adorcom Media Group? Yes. First of all, hearty congratulations on your completion of two successful years and that to bringing so many educators together under the same roof, sharing of so good, valuable inputs. So I wish them good luck and looking forward for many new ideas like this concept of like, uh, uh, like what we are talking about from improvement from here to there. So this, I want this to be continued. Okay. Thank, Thank you so much, ma'am, for joining us today. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am.